Welcome to the Sertara training course, Non-Compartmental Data Analysis. Before we get started with the course material, let's take a few minutes to see what this course is all about. Non-Compartmental Analysis, abbreviated NCA, is a fundamental tool used to analyze pharmacokinetic data. It is a way of analyzing drug concentration time data to understand better how the body handles the drug. In this course, you will learn how to calculate parameters associated with non-compartmental analysis, what those parameters mean, what their impact is, and how to interpret changes in the parameters. We will examine all the equations and methodologies that are employed in NCA. The course content is structured into three kinds of activities, video lectures, exercises, and review quizzes. We have one or more video lectures for each topic in the course. Each lecture is only a few minutes long and is focused on the information you really need to know. We have between one and three lectures per topic. For the exercises, you will get the opportunity to do some calculations on your own. You will not need any special PK analysis software for these exercises. You will need some sort of spreadsheet program that is also capable of performing linear regressions to obtain slopes and intercepts. We will be using Microsoft Excel to demonstrate the solutions to the exercises, but you could use any program with similar capabilities to do the exercises. And the third type of activity is review quizzes. The review quizzes are at the end of each topic in the course for you to test your understanding of the material before you proceed. And here is a look at the topics that we will cover in the training course, including Observe Parameters, Half-Life, Area Under the Curve, or AUC, Clearance, Statistical Moments, Data Presentation, Bioequivalence, Study Design Considerations, and the Limitations of NCA. This course should help you either in your current profession or if you are trying to get a new job in pharmacokinetic analysis. Welcome aboard and let's proceed with the course.